Um, this morning, I got a call from one of the teachers from the school who had informed me that they had found some ballots under a desk. Um, the first person that was called was another candidate. Picture started to circulate of the of the ballots that they found. Um, they, and the elections and boxes personnel were not informed as yet. So when they found out about it, they went to the school as well, and we all met up there and then um, the police got involved and of course you know the ballots were not supposed to be touched or anything so then the police um, retrieved the ballots and took it to the police station statements were made from the the teachers and everything that found it and then um, at the JP Mr. Novello got involved and he explained cordially to all four chairperson candidates that um, if there's any other step to be taken, we would have to go to get a court order from the Supreme Court. For me, I thought that was the end of it. Um, so I didn't give it much, much mind. A couple of minutes later, I got a call um, saying that we should head over to the Kikaka Village Council Community Center because we're going to have a recall. And I were I was in contact with, with, with a lawyer and the lawyer was telling me there's no way that a recon could have been done. It needs to be done we you know if there it's the recon you have to there's a process involved, you have to write within seven days and then the process can be done and it's illegal to do a recon. So um the elections and voters asked if I could sign up a document and I said, no, well, I'm not signing anything. Uh, election and Bongers had to communicate back with their headquarters and then they decided that they can't do a recon. They have to do a reconciliation process. So that's what was done. Um, the ballots, they had to open the entire A box and they went through all the ballots, all the chairperson. That contestants are run. I, uh, saw everything and then everybody was satisfied and they declared it that every it, the ballots were not tampered with and the, and the decision and the results matched back and was reconciled to exactly what was counted last night. Who was the candidate who requested a recount? Um, Mr. Badillo, he requested the, the recount. Um, I, he lost by 13 votes and I, I guess he cannot concede that he lost by 13 votes. Um, someone have to win, someone have to lose. So I hope he concedes now.